Hey everyone, Mike Wolf here, founder of MikeWolfMastery.com and today I am in Kansas City, Missouri and really excited to be here because uh, for the first time ever we have financing on U.S. properties. Even if you're Canadian, Australian, European, doesn't matter, we've got financing uh, with very easy qualifying, 35% uh, down and uh, more importantly though, obviously the properties have to be, uh, make sense and be good uh, or financing is irrelevant. So we have the perfect combination. Uh, I'm in a place called Raytown, which is a suburb of, uh, as I mentioned, Kansas City. And be careful what Kansas City you're talking about, because there is a state of Kansas, which is very close to here. Very different real estate market there. And it's very uh, tenant friendly there. Here it's very landlord friendly here in Missouri, which is why we're here. So I'm gonna take you through uh, just a sample of property here. This property is worth around $93,000. With 35% uh, down, you're looking, you know, roughly $30,000 cash, and the rest will be financed for you. Let's uh, take a peek inside here. It's been all fully renovated. Uh, it's a three-bedroom up. It's got a fourth bedroom in the basement. Should rent for around $1,100 a month. And uh, come on in. I want to go in because it is cold out here. I'm the wimpiest Canadian ever. So we'll start upstairs here. We've got uh, hardwood floors that have been uh, refinished. Uh, the house looks great. So we've got uh, brand new blinds uh, in the house. It's of course been repainted. So there's a nice big deck. It's a, it's a huge backyard. I've got to go back outside again. But it's a huge backyard out here. And as you can see, it's a it's a, just a really big piece of land. You have a fair bit of distance from your neighbors, which is always nice. Uh, the roof has been uh, redone. And now I get to go back inside. I'm excited about this. So uh, this is obviously the kitchen over here. And so I've got, uh, got a whole bunch of information. One of the things I, I like to do when I check out a new market is to basically look at the comparables. What are the other homes in the neighborhood going for? And so here's some of the properties that are uh, very close to here. And we tried to get them as similar as possible. We have stuff, you know, 1049, these, these are list prices, 115, 120, 135. Some of these are bigger homes, which explains why they're so much more expensive. But it's good to be in a neighborhood where you have that kind of uh, uh, room in the price. Uh, these are some that have actually sold. And uh, this one was listed at 107.9, sold for 107.9. These are all recent sales, by the way. We're not going, I don't look at stuff that sold a year or two or three years ago. It's irrelevant. Uh, we have one here that was listed at 112.9, sold for 103. Another one sold for 114.5, sold for 110. So uh, now what we'll do is we'll uh, take a uh, peek throughout here. It's got three bedrooms up. So we've got, uh, we'll start off with, a, we'll film the bathroom here first. Yeah, and then there's three bedrooms, they're not, uh, they're not huge, but they definitely uh, do the trick and it's a good, uh, makes a great rental property. So let's take a peek here, we've got two more bedrooms up. Pretty uh, typical traditional layout. And then we'll just uh, head downstairs here really quick. So we're just going to the garage here. Uh, as you can see, it's a double uh, double attached garage. Uh, the uh, floor has been uh, painted. I recommend you do this, by the way, in any of your uh, revenue properties. Just gives it a nice, clean look. Gets rid of the oil stains. And after you've gone to the trouble of, of uh, renovating a property, when people walk through, this is typically going to be the last thing they see. And if everything else looks brand new, and they get to the garage, and it 
all of a sudden doesn't feel new to them anymore, that's the impression they're going to leave with. We don't want that. So we want tenants or your future home buyer, when you resell the home, we want them to feel like it's a, as new as possible. So uh, this is going to be the uh, laundry room, furnace room, hot water tank, all that. Everything's been uh, replaced and repaired. And uh, everything was inspected. And all of the repairs were done on it. And then we've got uh, what has become another bedroom here. And the thing that's really cool about this is it has its own full bath in here. And it's also got a, 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 some patio doors. You can actually spray out into the backyard from here. So if you wanted, if uh, you ever wanted to kind of turn this into a little self-contained suite, 